Hi everyone, I'm Russ Hamilton. I'm a retired sergeant with California Department of Corrections and Rehabilitation. Hey there, Tier Talk fans, along with my Keepers of Chaos, which is where we're going to port this to from Tier Talk here in just a minute. Thought I'd do a quick little video, get some input, get some discussion from you guys on, I wouldn't call it a controversial subject, but it's something kind of out there a little bit. What does everyone out there think about gut instinct? Have you ever had it happen to you inside uh, our particular uh, institution, our particular profession? Um, I have uh, quite a few times. I'll never forget the first time it ever happened to me that I could really identify it that way. I was working this little yard with probably about 400 inmates on it. It was the size of maybe like three or four basketball courts. And I was walking along and I saw this one inmate hand another inmate a sandwich and something deep down inside of me just said, hey, wait a second. And I stopped and reached down and uh, grabbed the sandwich and stepped back away from these guys. And there was a syringe in it. And I thought, wow, how, how did I do that? And, um, you know, personally, I think it's just all about your subconscious keys on something that you really can't be aware of at the conscious level. And somehow between those two divides of subconscious and conscious, somehow some communication takes place. And uh, I'm not going to go into a, you know, a bunch of uh, different theories and stuff on that. But quite a few times through the years, I've had that happen. Um, I had an incident happen where I was outside in the foyer area and I saw a gentleman talking to uh, one of uh, one of my officers and just something didn't quite feel right. So I went over and I asked her, I said, what was that guy? And she said that he was just asking for directions or something. And I said, well, where was he? And so I got some officers out there. We started searching the area where he was and there was a garbage can out there and it had dope in it. And so anyway, needless to say, we set up on that and there was an outside, uh, you know, uh, minimum, uh, minimum custody uh, crew that would come along at night and empty all of the garbage cans out. And uh, anyway, they paid the price for that. So anyway, really like to hear some of your experiences, though, and what you have to say about it. And the times where you just went, whoa, how did I pull that off? How did I know that that particular inmate at that particular time had contraband on him? Or how did I know that that attack was about to take place? It's all around us. I mean, I've seen it many times where I've had officers just man, they just knew something was about to happen or they knew where something was and they really couldn't explain it. So let's have some input. Let's uh, stir up some discussion on this. Anyway, I um, hope you guys like this video. I hope you're going to participate and we'll just see uh, what people have to say. All right. Ciao. Whoa.